What would the world be like without magnets? You could not listen to the radio because the speakers would not work. Your phone would not be able to vibrate. And airplanes would not be able to fly either. These devices depend on various types of magnets. There are magnets that are made out of iron, nickel, and cobalt. Some magnets are created with electricity. But the strongest, permanent magnets are made with rare earth metals. The world depends on magnets. But not every magnet helps the world. Rare earth magnets are useful, but mining for the metals to make them have many negative repercussions. Despite their name, rare earth metals are found all over the world. However, only a few countries mine and process them, limiting availability. Of the few countries that actually refine rare earth metals, China owns the majority of the market. Without a strong competition, China effectively has a monopoly. Furthermore, these processing and manufacturing factories cause many environmental issues. The processing of the metal pollutes the air, poisons the water, and destroys the earth. To add to this problem, rare earth metals are found naturally with hazardous radioactive materials. But there is a solution. Virginia Commonwealth University's Dr. Everett Carpenter and his team have created a cobalt carbide magnet, an alternative to some rare earth magnets. This alternative will create market competition and growth. Creating the cobalt carbide magnet is environmentally friendly and created without deadly gas emissions and waste. And it is made in the United States of America. For the same price, cobalt carbide magnets have a higher energy density than other magnets. It is an innovative solution to a growing problem. The unique process on how it's made makes it a significant product for the magnet industry.